Yo, what is up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. As you've seen in the caption and in the thumbnail, we are doing our Monster Bass unboxing. Yes, sir. We got the orange box this time. If you ain't seen the new, the newest uh, takeover with Monster Bass, I'm about to show you right here. So if you are new here, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on future content because we do have a Monster Bass or no, not a Monster Bass, a Mystery Tackle Box unboxing coming soon, as well as a Six Sense unboxing. Also, if you have not seen this video, you do not know about the giveaway, so make sure you go check this video out right here to uh, hear about the giveaway and what's gonna be in the giveaway. I actually show what's gonna be in the giveaway as well. So head over to this video, after this video, of course, to hear about the rules and regulations of that giveaway to win that giveaway. I'm actually probably gonna be doing a giveaway um, announcement on Instagram live, so make sure you go follow me on Instagram at Bozeman underscore co. Also, never forget to leave those beautiful loving comments down below to enter yourself into being in the comment of the day. And with that being said, comment of the day is popping up down below, read it. Like it, love it, let's go. And we also gonna go ahead and shout out the most recent subscribers. First most recent subscriber is Elieso, oh wait, Elieso Cortez, Purple Bass Thumb, and Brett King. Shout out to y'all, love y'all, thank you for the support, and keep on supporting. If you can, get that, hit that share button as well to show even more support. All right, now let's get into this unboxing, yes, sir. That Monster Bass box. We got this orange beautiful box right here. Let's go. I actually did an add-on with this as well, so I'm going to go ahead and pull that out first. And you already know what, you already know what time it is. Or actually, we got our books and uh, all of that cool stuff to show you guys. So you, if you ever heard, there is a Monster Bass Takeover by Lunker Hunt. So this is the first pamphlet. Uh, it also shows all their lures that they have. Well, yeah, it does show. Most popular for their frog. They got paddle tails, they got frogs, they got uh, Ned rigs. Now they got worms, and they also got that big eye, uh, like jigging bait with that big old hook on the bottom right here. Bam. Um, and all of that cool stuff in here. Coming soon is a bay blade. It looks like or a bladed, a bladed. Looks like a bladed, um, a bladed bait. I'm guessing. That's super, super cool. It's called the. Uh, Bosch blade, Bosch blade. That's a cool name for that. Also, we have our golden ticket as well. We also got us a new sticker, that Lunker Hunt sticker, and then we got the discount discount code card and all of that beautiful stuff right there. Look at that. That's sick. That is so dope. And we got the add-on which was a rod sleeve, a monster bass rod sleeve. I got it in that red color, that monster bass on the side. Damn. Love these. I'm gonna go ahead and slap this on the rod real quick. I'm gonna put it on this one right here. My light, my light rod. Yes, sir. I've got the blue and the green. <laughs> Puma, stop chewing stuff. So I think we gonna start off with Oh, we're going to start off with this, actually. We're going to start off with the face mask. Set the face mask. Open that up. Ooh, this is sick. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the collaboration. Is that? No, I think that's just Monster Bass. Look at that, dude. Sick. We got that, like, Joker face mask on it with that Monster Bass logo on the bottom, front and back. I'm about to go ahead and slap this bad boy on. Oh, <laughs> right there. Look at that. Got that big smile on my face. Yes, sir. All right. I'm digging that. That's my first face. That's my second face mask of 2022. All right. Now we're going to start with the 
pre rigged soft plastics. Let's go. So we have a Lunker Hunt bait shifter, minnow, 3.1 inch, in the color of. We got those salt, say salt hooks. What's the color? Got that sexy melon. That sexy melon soft plastic. It's a hollow body for this jig. So basically, it comes rigged, ready to rig. Just crack open the box and start it. So we're going to figure this out. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing we're probably going to go ahead and slide that bad boy in that hole right there. We're going to slide it right down the soft plastic, get it in there good. And then it pop, uh, pops out right there. We got us a little swim bait on the jig. Nice. Hey, tube. Almost like a tube jig. Bam. Got that watermelon. Uh, fluorescent flake, black flake, green flake all in there. Those nice little eyes on there. Dude, look at that thing. That's even sick. Nice paddle on there. Pretty sure this will get ate up. That you know. That Harson's Island. Yes, sir. All right. Second pre wig pre rig soft plastic. It is in a green pumpkin color. And this is the Lunker Hunt pre rig finesse worm weighing in at one fourth ounce, three inch. So this is a soft plastic, not pre rig And then we have pre-rig on that Ned rig jig look at that dude that is awesome got a lot of action on there pop that thing that thing's gonna flap like crazy it's actually flat on there it's almost built like those um those ocho neds literally almost identical to be honest so we got that weed guard there and that weed guard is trash to be honest i see these at walmart all the time and uh at bass pro shop and i'll never really get them because i have so much ned rig stuff like but to have them nice and pre-rig say if you know you forget all your ned rig jigs at home you could just walk into bass pro shop any sporting goods show all right on to the next soft plastic now that that all that stuff is out of the way um we also got the lunker hunt what are these called? These are Lunker Hunt sticks. Five inch worm. Where's you? And the color of this is cigar. I had to smell them real quick, make sure they didn't smell like cigars. <laughs> uh, super salty. Just off top. It smells just like plastic. Just look at that color. I had some good luck on um, some worms similar, uh, some stick bait similar to this color. Um, I don't think I got a punk hanging up. But basically, they were like half that like purple color in there. Come on, half that purple color in there, and then that black. It was like basically a natural color for that. Um, I had some real good luck with that those that color this is like a pearl purple color in black or like plum i should say plum color there beautiful stick but i would never think to use this color ever which is super cool honestly lunker hunt is not something i'm like oh i'm about to run a bass pro shop and go grab me some lunker hunt sticks like you know or like I grabbed their frog, you know, but even then their frogs, I don't know. All right, so that was the last soft plastic. Now, all right, now we're gonna go ahead head over to the first hard bait, weighing in at one fourth ounce. Length is 1.7 inches. We have that Lunker Hunt popping frog. Let's go, looking beautiful in the package. It says pop right on the side, so you know what's about that action. All right. 
I'm gonna take it out of the package. Very small presentation. Um, legs, I've seen these and I'm like, they're not gonna be that good, but just by seeing, now, this is like the first time I actually held one of these and the legs are moving really well. I could see those um, look imitating a real frog very well. And then that popping is just gonna make, stir up all that commotion. So yeah, that popping's gonna make all that commotion on the top water. Then they're gonna see those legs. Oh, we have a little small frog swimming around. Whack! It's gonna get hit with those hooks right there. Hookup ratio is gonna be freaking phenomenal. Look how those the hooks are kind of like shaped in a weird way, and the hooks are like hooked up to the eye right there, which is like super cool. Like this thing is like I'm spinning this. And I think that's going to work very well. It's not coming out. I've never seen a frog built like this. I've always seen frogs with the hooks like connected to the um, two hooks in the back. Yeah, it's like not even like close to being connected. That's, that's cool. I'm most definitely going to try this out. I know Amanda wants to try this small finesse poop frog out. She likes the little tiny frogs. All right, so now we're on to the next hard bait, and we're gonna go ahead and go with that lovely um, square bill. I actually have a couple of these. Found them on a three dollar deal at Myers. A lot of you probably won't even know what Myers is. It's a Michigan uh, grocery store. It's like one of our big grocery stores that are literally like Myers is like the Walmart, but like for like rich people, I guess you could say. Not like a Whole Foods though, but it's like it's like a local grocery store basically. So sit in that beautiful package. What color is this actually? The color of it is silver, silver side. Um, it is zero to two point five feet. So this would be a good like pond crankbait. Be a very good cr pond crankbait. Uh, most shads look like this in ponds, like minnows and stuff, but this is more like a bigger presentation. It could uh, be a, just a massive day. I think it is a massive minnow and absolutely smoke this thing. We got that black top with that lunker hunt on the top there. And then we got that silver side, um, silver side, silver gills with that traditional bluegill dot, black pupils, silver eyes. Uh, ghost like body with that um, brown lateral line very detailed pearl white bottom beautiful bait good pond pond lure for sure hooks are absolutely phenomenal rattle is awesome as well love it if you ain't gotta get it Nice bill on there as well. It's just a cheap bill. It look like it'll break pretty easy to be honest. Zero to two feet. Most definitely a pond. Hit it, uh, swim it past those drains and all that stuff. Or those spills. I think it'll get smoked. All right, on to the next hard bait. We have the Lunker Thump. Lunker Thump impact addition impact series we have a, a spinner bait not willow i forgot what it's uh it's not a willow but it is that electric electric shad i'm guessing electric shad color beautiful gold baits white is her truth white is her truth is literally the most perfect color for any situation possible White and Sir Truth is perfect. Got that black line on the side, Sir Truth, top of the head of that jig. Um, white bottom and all that beautiful stuff. Let's go. Very sharp hook. Horrible bait keepers, but most definitely probably just put a trailer hook on that and not even use a trailer. <laughs> Very good skirt. Hand tied skirt. Awesome. Oh, this thing is sweet. Got that lunker hunt engraved into the side of that thing, dude. That's dope. 
Never use this style spinnerbait. I always use like the Willow style. But now I got this in my arsenal. Okay, and we are on to the next hard bait. And I believe this is the last hard bait. Lunker Hunt take over. I like it so far. And I think this last bait is probably my first favorite. Not my second, my first favorite. This is a Lunker Hunt weighing in at eight or three eighths ounce. Sorry, dyslexic. Three eighth ounce, the big eye tail spin. Look at that thing, dude. This is super exciting because I know six cents. I'm actually probably gonna get on sixcents.com and actually cop some of their their lures that are similar to this. Because theirs look really, really good. The color of it is what? Green glow. Fluorescent green glow is the color. Let me take it out of the package. Very good hooks on there. So this, uh, from what I know, would be a good like striper, um, striper bass, um, um, jigging, ice. You can use this for ice fishing. Very versatile lure right there. All lead. That whole body is completely leaded out. Nice one hook up under the bottom there. And that beautiful blade on the back. I wonder if I could switch this into like a willow blade. That'd be sick. We'll just put a huge willow blade on the back of that bad boy. Although we had a lot of distractions in this video, we got it done. Um the Lugger Hunt takeover was a pretty awesome takeover. I never really looked too much in the Lunker Hunt, but now I got the lures to do so. I actually got a couple of Lunker Hunt um, spinner baits, and I believe, actually, I said I did. I actually said that I didn't have too many styles like this, but I actually got a couple of more Lunker Hunt. But I got the black and blue color of this as well. Found them on a deal. You got a potty? Come on. So yeah, the Lunker Hunt takeover was um, a pretty good takeover. Never really thought to use too many. I actually have some Lunker Hunt, Lunker Hunt spinner baits. I just literally just said I don't have any like this. I have never had any luck on Lunker Hunt. Lures, I got the black and blue color, same thing, just silver blades. Um, Lunker Hunt takeover was dope. Didn't know Lunker Hunt did these. I know they do a bigger swim bait like this, but I didn't know they had the small paddle tails like that. So I'm gonna have to go check them out, see if they got some sexy shad colors or something like that. Cause that'd be a good uh, St. Clair lure. Even that color by itself would be a good St. Clair lure, I think. Um, the next Monster Bass, um, the next Monster Bass unboxing there is another takeover as well. And I believe it's the Z-Man takeover from what I hear. Um, I think I heard that. Maybe. So make sure I hit the notification bell so y'all don't miss out on that. Because I love Z-Man. I'm pretty sure y'all love Z-Man too. The elastic and all that. Stretchy soft plastics and all that stuff. I really think they should do more takeovers. Like maybe a Strike King takeover or something like that. In the mix, maybe that'll happen. Uh, leave it leave it down in the comments what takeover y'all think Monster Bass should do. You know what I mean? Because I can think of 100, you know, and all that beautiful stuff. It is sad to say this is the end of the video. I hope you liked it. I hope you love it. Make sure you hit that share button. Show some more support. Make sure you're all hitting that subscribe button, that like button, and notification bell so you don't miss out on some great content. It is very sad to say, yeah, again, this is the end of the video, and I'll see you guys. Next time, peace out. Peace out.